Bloomberg Johnson reporting about concerns, certainly amongst the Democratic camp, that maybe Trump comes out and declares himself winner prematurely. What, what is the risk in the days ahead of that kind of response, and how much resilience is there in the system to, to cope with that? The specific issue is that under the state rules, when they count ballots, uh, Pennsylvania doesn't start counting early votes until the polls have closed. That's why they came in so late last time, as did Michigan. What we saw in 2020 is what we're going to see again this year. Donald Trump came out between 2, 3 a.m. in the morning, our time, uh, here in the U.K. and in Ireland, and he declared that he had won. He said, that's it. Now, he was trying to preempt, in fact, what then happened, that the vote shifted to Biden and gave Biden the victory. He may do the same thing this time. He will, if he is losing, whether it's narrow or even more substantial, he will almost certainly declare this a rigged election. He will put pressure on state legislators, on state governors to flip uh, the results. He will file series after series of legal cases. He will put pressures on Republican legislators in Congress to block the certification of Kamala Harris. But here's what is different this time. If his supporters go out on the streets and if they pursue violence, will Trump call them off or will he, as he did on January 6, 2021, stay silent or even support those who come out and carry out violence as patriots? I hope we don't get to that point, but that's the one we have to be prepared for.